Hi, in this video, we'll go over how to update a fire department's details and apparatus records. First, we need to look for a fire department to edit. Click fire departments in the top navigation bar, then click search fire departments. Enter some search criteria and then click search. Click on the first search result. You will see a form for that fire department where you can edit details. If you need to edit any of these fields, go ahead and type the value that you want into these fields. Some of these fields have a code lookup menu where you can choose between multiple choices. And that's basically it when it comes to editing basic fire department details. So you can click add personnel to add a new person to this fire department. It will bring up a form where you can add as many details about that person. When you're done, click add to add that person. And then you'll see that person with that person's details in this table. You can click edit to edit this person's information. and click delete to remove that person from this fire department. Now let's go over how to add apparatuses to this fire department. Just like how you added a new person, you can add a new apparatus. Click add apparatus and this will open a pop-up form. And then fill in as many details about this apparatus, then click add. Now you'll see the new apparatus in this table. Just like with personnel, you can click edit to edit the apparatus or delete to delete it. When you're done with all your changes, go ahead and click the Save button on the right to save your changes. The apparatus and personnel records created here can be used in an incident's apparatus and personnel module. In that module, the apparatus or personnel entries here will show up in their respective pick lists. In this video, we went over how to edit a fire department's details and add personnel and apparatuses to it. 